Hey Drop Tech fans, welcome back to the channel. Today, we're diving into some exciting news. One UI 7.0 is right around the corner. That's right, the wait is almost over, and it looks like this update is set to bring some major changes for Samsung Galaxy users. Based on recent leaks and a big reveal from Android headlines, we're expecting a substantial overhaul, not only in design but also with a load of new features that are going to make One UI 7 feel fresh and more powerful than ever. First, let's talk about what's getting a facelift. Samsung has made some changes to the stock app icons. In previous images, icons for apps like camera, contacts, and gallery didn't really stand out. They looked okay but weren't super exciting. Now, with these updates, Samsung has definitely made them a lot more appealing. The icons have been refined. One giving UI the 7 interface beta a fresh, has not been announced modern yet. Look that's easier on the eyes. One of the leaked images even gives us a closer look at a redesigned portrait studio. Here, you'll see the styling options positioned just below the image you're editing, making it easier to customize photos in real time. Plus, Samsung appears to be adding a new app called Cloud. This app is likely designed to be a hub for backing up all your essential data, photos, videos, files, contacts, messages, and call logs, so everything is safely stored in one place. This move seems like a big plus for those looking for more seamless data management and backup options. Now, throughout this video, you'll also spot some other exciting changes. Samsung has refreshed stock app icons across the board and introduced new widgets. One of the cool new features is a pill-shaped animation for ongoing activities like charging, music playback, timers, and the voice recorder. This animation is subtle but adds a sleek, modern touch to the interface. The quick panel has gotten a facelift too. It now features redesigned quick setting toggles, a music player widget that shows an icon for Galaxy Buds when they're connected, and updated sliders for brightness and volume control. Additionally, the Samsung Health app has a new look, introducing an energy score feature, along with enhanced health recommendations and summaries. It's clear Samsung wants users to have a more personalized and detailed health experience with this update. One UI 7.0 also brings enhanced options for parental controls, allowing parents to manage their children's device usage with a stronger focus on safety and content control. Samsung is really aiming to make devices more family-friendly and secure. And if you love the sketch-to-image feature that Samsung introduced with the Galaxy Z Flip 6 and Fold 6 in the One UI 6.1.1 update, get ready because this feature is about to get even better. Using Generative AI Samsung now lets you turn sketches into images with styles like 3D, cartoon, sketch, and watercolor. It's a fun and creative addition for those who enjoy a little extra customization. Now, let's touch on the design. Previous leaks have hinted that One UI 7 will bring a softer, more rounded look to icons and interface elements, making everything feel a bit smoother and more contemporary. The animations have also been polished, featuring new nonlinear and parallel animations when opening and closing apps. A short clip shared by Ice Universe showcases how fluid these animations look, with transitions that feel stable, glitch-free, and more natural. This is especially exciting for Samsung fans who love smooth animations. While iOS has often been seen as the king of smooth UI, One UI 7 might just be closing that gap. The leaked footage shows this update running on a Galaxy S25 or the S25 Plus, where you can spot redesigned icons for settings, gallery, phone, and camera. There's also a refreshed weather widget with a sleek, slim design compared to the previous version on One UI 6. It's clear that Samsung is putting a lot of effort into making One UI 7 feel fresh and comparable to the seamless experience that many associate with Apple's iOS. Samsung fans, you're going to love this shift in animation style and the overall improved look and feel. So, what do you all think of the upcoming One UI 7? Excited for the changes, or is there something else you're hoping for in this update? Let me know down in the comments. As always, stay tuned, and we'll catch you in the next video. Peace out.
Now, One UI 7.0 is going to have a slightly longer development cycle compared to previous versions, which means we'll need to be a bit more patient than usual. Device eligibility. Now let's get into the big question, which Samsung devices will get Android 15? While the official list won't be available until after the launch, we can make So here's a sneak peek at the Galaxy smartphone Galaxy S series, Galaxy S24 Ultra, Galaxy S24 Plus, Galaxy S24, Galaxy S23 Ultra, Galaxy S23 Plus, Galaxy S23, Galaxy S23 FE, Galaxy S22 Ultra, Galaxy S22 Plus, Galaxy S22, Galaxy S21 FE, Galaxy S21 Ultra, Galaxy S21 Plus, Galaxy S21, Galaxy Z Series, Galaxy Z Fold Special Edition, Galaxy Z Fold 6, Galaxy Z Fold 5, Galaxy Z Flip 6, Galaxy Z Flip 5, Galaxy Z Fold 4, Galaxy Z Flip 4, Galaxy Z Fold 3, Galaxy Z Flip 3, Galaxy A Series, Galaxy A73, Galaxy A55, Galaxy A54, Galaxy A53, Galaxy A35, Galaxy A34, Galaxy A33, Galaxy A25, Galaxy A24, Galaxy A23, Galaxy A15, LTE Plus 5G, Galaxy A14, LTE Plus 5G, Galaxy A16, LTE Plus 5G, Galaxy Tab Series, Galaxy Tab S10 Plus, Galaxy Tab S10 Ultra, Galaxy Tab S9 FE Plus, Galaxy Tab S9 FE, Galaxy Tab S9 Ultra, Wi Fi slash 5G, Galaxy Tab S9 Plus, Wi Fi slash 5G, Galaxy Tab S9, Wi Fi slash 5G, Galaxy Tab S8 Ultra, Wi Fi slash 5G, Galaxy Tab S8 Plus, Wi Fi slash 5G, Galaxy Tab S8, Wi Fi slash 5G, Galaxy S Series, Galaxy F55, Galaxy F54, Galaxy F34, Galaxy F15, Galaxy N Series, Galaxy M55S, Galaxy M55, Galaxy M54, Galaxy M34, Galaxy M53, Galaxy M33, Galaxy M15. This list is based on previous updates, so it's a pretty solid guess on what we can expect, but remember, it's unofficial until Samsung makes their official announcement. Wrapping up, with Android 15 bringing some exciting new features, it's definitely worth the wait for Galaxy users. And while the rollout for Samsung devices might be in early 2025, this unofficial list gives us a good idea of which models will be in line for the update. What do you think? Is your device on the list? Let me know in comments section.